Stick to the end of the video to find out how you can win a copy of the Southeast Asia Animal Pack. Good luck! Hey guys, it's Zekin and welcome back to Planet Zoo. Today we finally get our hands on the Southeast Asia Animal Pack. Which is very exciting because we get 8 different animals this time, instead of the 4 or 5 we got in the past DLCs. So the wonderful people at Vert Frontier put together a little bit of a collaboration between 8 different content creators. So, we were each assigned to make a habitat for each animal from the DLC and I was assigned the giant Malaysian leaf insect. And I know what some of you must be thinking, oh, it's an exhibit animal, that must be boring. Well, don't click away just yet because I put a lot of love into the architecture, landscaping and just overall design that I think makes it look interesting. So why don't you see for yourself? So before I go in any further, I just want to run you guys through my thought process when I was coming up with a design for this build. At first I was thinking of something along the lines of really modern and stylistic, but it ended up not working out quite well. I had the entire idea in my head, but when I actually went on to build it, it wasn't really going the way I wanted it to, so I ended up just scrapping the idea. Then I decided I wanted to focus on traditional aspects of architecture from Southeast Asia. Specifically for this build, I narrowed it down to Malaysian vernacular architecture, which is where the leaf bug comes from. I don't want to bore you guys too much with the details right now, but I'll catch you guys later in the life portion after the stop motion build. Okay, so hope you enjoyed that little stop motion bit. Now we're going to be taking a look at the uh, the building as well as taking a deep look at the Malaysian leaf insect. So, as I said, it is very much inspired by a lot of Malaysian vernacular architecture and a lot of it uses a lot of wood in their buildings because that is what is readily available there. So, there they incorporated in a lot of different carvings and into their architecture and I tried my best to put that in the build as much as I did with all these different details and the roof and all these side profiles as well. So here is a look at the Malaysian leaf insect. You can see one over there. It doesn't, it doesn't really do much actually because obviously it's an exhibit animal but it's just it's actually my kind of sort of favorite um, animal, exhibit animal in the game so far. They're just really high quality and they're, um, you can see one over here as well. They're really high quality and like the modeling is just top notch. So really love that about them. So, so yeah, so I did a little bit of gardening around the, um, the building. That's because I wanted it to feel more lively and more colorful. Uh, so I added in some hanging baskets as well. And I also put in some lights. So we're going to be checking that out in nighttime very shortly. 
So fun fact, these um lipstick palms are actually from uh, a lot from Malaysia, so I obviously had to implement them into the build as well. And I really like these little bamboo uh, lights I made out of like uh, shapes and bamboos and a bowl and I just really like how they look. So let's check it out at night. Okay, so here is a look at it at night and I say I'm really really happy with how it ended up turning out. Uh, I didn't really put too much lighting because I didn't want it to be like overly unrealistic and um, too bright. I just made it really really nice and subtle enough so you can find your way through the pathing and around the building as well. So here's how the bamboo lights light, light up. They have this really nice down lighting and I'm really happy with how that ended up turning out. So, so yeah, I'll be leaving links below to the blueprint so you can put it in your own parks and have fun with it. Thanks to the wonderful people over at Frontier, I'm going to be giving away two copies of the Southeast Asia Animal Pack. So if you want to stand a chance of winning, all you have to do is to one, leave a like on the video, two, if you're not subscribed already, be sure to do so and turn on the notification bell, and lastly, at number three, comment below what your favorite animal is from the pack, as well as putting in the hashtag SEA Pack. So that's hashtag SEA Pack. I'll be running all the entries through a random comment picker and I'll pick the winners in exactly 24 hours from when this video goes up. So good luck! Once again big shout out to the devs for their massive support so far and hope you enjoy the video. I'll be leaving links below to my social so you can go follow me on there and I'm still planning on a special project for the Southeast Asia pack so be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on that when it comes out. So yeah, see you later guys and until then, bye for now.